<laughs> How about you people from Massachusetts? How you feel about being a scapegoat or a scapegoat for the killing of the health care bill by voting that Robert Stone into office? Huh? <laughs> Ain't that a wonderful feeling? Some of these stupid ass politicians, some of these damn stupid ass talk show hosts or gossip hosts or whatever the hell you want to call them, trying to blame y'all for it. Hell, you just voted in the damn person you thought would do the best for your state. You know? At least some of the bucks are really worried about damn health care reform and shit. That damn bill wouldn't have to depend on 60 votes. Hell, they'd, they'd had the whole 100 damn, damn votes. If they were really serious about doing health care for the American people, but no. They, they just want to beat it back and forth amongst themselves, use it for a damn political, uh, uh, use it for a political hostage for their elections and every damn thing else. And I'll tell you what now, uh, I don't know. I just think it's crazy that they're, they done all this damn shit to get a health care bill passed, got this far with it, and just because they lost, they didn't even lose a vote. You know what? If they were really serious about this damn health care bill, they should have went ahead and finished out the process of it, which Old Stone, he ain't been seated yet that I know of. I don't know when they're going to swear him into office or seat him, as they say. But they probably, they could still go on with the procedure on his health care bill. And my God, if the damn Democrat or if the Republicans voted out, you know, or voted down, hell, that's still 41 59 still the majority it still passes the only thing of it is it's just a <coughs> they want a 60 vote damn count to keep the uh, so there won't be no no uh, um, shit no threat of a filibuster on this you know that's the only reason why they want that damn 60 vote, because they're worried about a damn filibuster. They can pass it with a 59 majority. So if they're really serious about this damn health care bill, then by God, continue on with the friggin' uh, procedure on it. Throw it up there, get a damn house, or uh, get the votes on it. And if it gets shot down, well, by God, at least you say you uh, done it out to the damn end. You know? None of this damn half-ass bullshit that y'all trying to do any damn was. I even hear them talking to, by God, y'all want to pass, they, they're talking about passing it. And then tweak and fine-tune it after it already gets into law. Or uh, and everything. Well, by God, you, it ain't so damn easy for them to peek and tweak and tune this damn thing. If there's any tweaking or peeking or tuning or whatever the hell it is they want to call it, and by God, it should have been done already. And and what the hell is this? Oh, well, well, we ain't got enough votes to pass the Senate bill in the House. But we can pass the House bill in the House, so we might do that. No, you dumbasses. You're supposed to combine the two damn bills into one and post and and, and, and have it passed in both the House and Senate. None of this, well, we'll do this one, then we'll peek and tune it. Fuck that bullshit. You got damn people up in Washington ain't serious about a damn health care bill? No way, sir. It wouldn't have took this damn long. So, you people of Massachusetts, don't let this... If you hear anybody complaining that y'all are the ones that stopped the health care bill because you elected that man to the damn Senate, 
tell people to kiss your ass. <clears throat> Cause that damn that's bullshit. What you do, you you got out there and you elected a man you wanted to, as your damn state senator. And that's what you did. And I'll tell you one damn thing. He may be. He also may be a Republican. And they may say to all the Republicans of Massachusetts done this, done that. Well, I'll tell you what. Where the hell were all the damn uh, Democrat voters and Teddy, Teddy Kennedy voters that kept that damn man in office for 47 friggin' years? You know? Was he that damn... I mean, the man dies and all of a sudden the damn... You couldn't find anyone else to carry out the values that that man stood for, or what you thought he stood for, or was y'all just voting for a damn Kennedy, no matter what the hell he did for y'all state, you know? So, that's just a couple things for y'all to think about on this damn health care bill and blaming Massachusetts for it. That's bullshit. And I'll tell you another damn thing. You know, everybody looks towards Massachusetts on universal health care. Well, if I'm not mistaken, if I remember correctly, Oregon also has a damn universal health care plan for their state. So, you know, everybody might want to start looking at the damn two plans and, and try to figure out what the hell is going on. So, that's all I got for that one. And I don't blind, I ain't got a damn thing against Massachusetts people. So, adios.